Welcome back to Commentary. I am Ari and we are playing Cat Cafe Manager again today. Are you hyped for cute cats? I am. So let's jump in. Day, oh, I'd love to visit. I'll head out now. Let's go. Please stop by the Pet Emporium soon. I really don't have that many other customers. Alright. Oh, Cat bed and the cardboard box. Hi. Hi. Hello dear! Today is just lovely, isn't it? Your grand love days like this as well. She'd stroll around town, a cat on each shoulder. Have you adjusted to living in Catawall? I imagine there are far less garden witches than you're used to in the city. Um. <laughs> just balcony witches in the city, actually. Quite taken with Catawall witches, actually. Uh, witches, oh my god, cut a wall. I'm pleased to hear it. At this rate, you had best pa start participating, balancing cats on your shoulders, dear. <laughs> I do hope you feel welcome, dear. Say, if you happen to have any questions about witches or cut a wall, I would be more than happy. I would be more than happy to answer them, dear. Um, can garden witches do magic? Kala Lala spits out her tea, presenting you with the molecular mo molecular idea of the mid-90s comic technique known as spit take. I am sorry, that is, such, such, that is just such an adorable question. You really do not know much about witches, do you? Magic is a children's story, dear. Witches just make potions to cure cold, rid you of boils, or make you float a little. We also talk to animals, but that's a closely guarded secret, hidden for many generations. 
Any other questions? Um, do you know anything about that cat shrine? Oh, the cat shrine deep in the forest. I heard you were advocating for its renovation. How lovely. I know of it, but have no idea what it is. The town's stray cats are quite taken with it, however. They are always lounging around there. They are vague, uh, I have a vague memory of a scary story the elder witches of my coven used to tell me to keep witchy kids out of the woods. If you ventured too close to the cat shrine, the shadow cat would make you its servant, and you would stay in the, in the forest until the end of your days. Someone should really tell the other witches to stop being so spooky all the time. Um, well, have there always been witches in Catawall? Actually, yes! Witches played an important role in the town's history. When the first settlers arrived here, they found the valley home to a tribe of wild cats. The cats hissed and scratched the settlers until they fled. Once wise old one wise old witch made many sardine sacrifices to appease them. I don't remember the rest of the story, but I imagine they lived happily ever after. Um, out of questions, Carla. Thanks for the pleasant conversation, dear. Now, I have some frogs to visit. Not to talk to them, because I cannot. Goodbye, dear. Alright. Got a potion. And we got my stuff. Alright. Well, let's put the potions. <laughs> wow, it's just a huge potion. Oh, but we got some stuff again. Ooh, like an inner garden? No, it's away. Oh, shoot. Shoot. Alright, let's see. Oh, we can make the walls another color. Yes, let's do that. Ah, oh, it looks hideous. What have I done? Not sure if I like that either, but... Whatever, um... This looks just like the outside of the place, I don't know. Maybe this? Yeah, I mean, I guess this looks alright. Um. Oh, I don't have any resources anymore. I see. Sorry, sir. chance to make progress. Actually, let me see if I can get the beer recipe. Hmm. No? Is 
Did I not see it somewhere? Or maybe I have to unlock it. I probably have to unlock it. Yes, I unlocked it. Like new project. I need uh, this one for new cats. Actually, wait, I can get more stuff now. Oh yeah, litter box, flora litter box, okay. We need way more stuff. We need to invite businessman again. I guess we're just gonna invite everybody. I had offered to help out, but turns out I don't actually care. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Definitely need a cat toilet. Oh wait, I can train some cats again. Hmm. Let's make you an all rounder. I don't know what I need. I guess business. Business sounds good. Um. Oh yes. All cats are pretty, but this one is pretty. <laughs> Um, crew, did I just cut? Okay, no, I want this one. Yes. Give me more business, though. Alright. That's all of the thingies I have. All of the stars. God, why is there so much going on right now? I guess I need a second uh, second higher actually. So who do we call today? I mean, I kinda wanna go with him again. Uh, yo. True, but yeah, okay, whatever. Um. Oh. Because this is a lot right now. Uh, 
Oh, he wants beer, right? Oh, oh that's nice. Oh, oh, that's nice. Oh, yeah. Hi. <laughs> I mean, we're also making a lot of fans. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, uh -huh. yeah. Oh. Yo, fancy seeing you here in your workplace, in your place of work. Uh, what's up, Ara? Let me get your opinion on a thing. So, I was arguing with my pal, um, Jim, Jim Jimbus, Jimbus, my good Paul Jimbus. He's uh studying to be a chef, like me. We argued about what's most important in a kick-ass meal. I say, Jimbus, my good friend, it's obvious, your ingredients. Get them fresh and chunky and hunky, and your dish will be delish. Now Jimbus, Jimbus is like, oh well, Aura, you're so smart, and without proper technique, those ingredients wouldn't matter one bit. So, who's right, me or Jimbus? I mean... <laughs> yeah, I don't think I don't think that guy exists. Genbus. <laughs> um, I don't know. I mean, it's both, but ingredients are probably the more important part. Because if you have bad ingredients, how I don't know. Hmm. What do I say? Should I just take this one because it's funny? What was Jimbus last name again? Uh, Tom? To Tombus. Jim Tombus. Jimbus Tombus. One of my many uh, real friends. I, I did a question, damn it. Um, I mean, ingredients are most important. Right? It doesn't matter what my te te uh, that my technique totally blows. No, that's not true. Take that, Jimbus, you total real person. Thanks for giving me your take. I already have tons of real friends like Jingus. <laughs> I wouldn't mind if you wanted to tell folks where Paul's. Where Paul's, Paul? Oh, uh, huh. Alright, Paul. I, uh, used to bud with Matteo too, but... We, uh, when we were little kids, but he got all weird. Stop being uh, into burning trash for fun. Started being into burn raids, whatever those are. And now he's offered to uh, the town up to Hawkable. I'm surprised he didn't get the golden platter out yet. Suddenly, Owl looks quite tired. I gotta go. Bye. This was quite kind of cute. Ooh, okay. Yes. Oh shit. Oh, oh. <laughs> so the punks are all gonna be really upset. <laughs> I mean, I have enough stuff to decorate again, but I guess we're gonna wait until the end of the day. Oh, <laughs> Let's redecorate. Oh, cat litter. What? Uh huh. We require four and we have eight, I think. Hmm. Well, anyway, uh, build. Um. Okay, let's see. How do, how do I actually want this place to look? Can I just demolish everything? Fantasy, two hipster, cool. Okay. Hmm. Okay. How about we build like a little kitchen area?
Why is it stuck on that field? What the heck? Oh my god, exit. Try it again. Is this stuck on our field? Weird. Like this, I can put this here and I mean it's not the nicest but it works out. It works out for now, I think. Go to the city. Um Should be enough for now. Why counter? Hmm. I mean, no, we don't need tables actually. Can we hire another person? No, we can't. I guess that's it then. Let's continue. Decorations? Oh, I still have a, ta um, a table, <laughs> a chair. Wow. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Wait, don't I even need to? Oh, I need to close, okay. <laughs> Again, okay, let's do that. Yeah, I guess maybe we should invite the business person, or I don't know. Hi, hello. Clear up my schedule for you, friendo. See you soon. <laughs> 